Hello and uh, welcome. Uh, thanks for joining me on this uh, video. I wanted to uh, demonstrate a pack takedown. Now that's later in the video, but uh, to start with, this is the uh, Scorpion G, well, the Rhine Metal Scorpion G, the uh, Tier 8 Premium uh, German Tank Destroyer. It's a pretty fun little tank. It doesn't have a lot of armor, but uh, it's got a good gun and uh, pretty good mobility. Now, surprisingly, it's supposedly based on a Panther hull, and I can see elements of a, a type of panther, you know, design. But it doesn't have the armor of a panther, unfortunately. But I guess you can't have everything. And really, at tier 8, that wouldn't do you a whole lot of good. But, you know, it would help a little. Now, when the starts, uh, battle starts here, I was looking around a little bit, deciding where I wanted to go. I generally like to go to the uh, main road um, slash boulevard there on the uh, 6 line, or 5-6 line that, you know, wraps around to the uh, F line. Now, a lot of times other tanks go there, so I, I try to go where I can help the most. And in this instance, nobody's going there, so I went ahead and grabbed my little spot here that I like. And I, I like to shoot across at tanks that are trying to zip across like that one, you know, to get to the, uh, the, the center circle, I guess. Uh, unfortunately, I wasn't quite set up in time, so I missed him. But, uh, you know, sitting here waiting. Oh, see, here we go. Chinese tank destroyer got spotted. I don't think I spotted him, but I did take a shot, got a nice hit, and then he pulls away. Unfortunately, I didn't track him. That would have been real nice. Got a second shot, but oh well. So I back up a little to uh, lessen the chance of any, anybody shooting me. It's uh, something I, I see the, the really good guys do, and I'm working on trying to do that more often. Now, right there, I was actually a little distracted. I think I was talking to my son, that or getting a drink of water. I'm not sure what. But anyway, I missed the shot on that tank going across, which was the whole point of my sitting there, is to shoot tanks going across. But uh, we get a shot on Scorpion G there, my uh, opposite on the enemy team. And we put a good hit into him. Now, unfortunately, though, here he's moving. I'm trying to aim, and my aiming reticle wasn't anywhere near aimed in. And this is a pretty accurate gun when you're aimed in, but when you're shooting on the move like that, uh, as you can see, mine hit the ground, and then I couldn't reload fast enough to get another shot before he got behind the corner. And he took out the M46, and as you can see, the M46 is a little salty there, uh, you know, saying that he shot first, but... You know, it's the thing about uh, playing these online games. It's not so much whether you shot first on your screen, it's whether the server recognizes that you shot first, and unfortunately the server recognized that the, uh, the enemy Scorpion G had shot first, so... It sucks, I hate it, but, you know, what can you do? So I decided to move up on that Scorpion because he hasn't poked out. And again, I fire on the move, and you can see all I did was track him, but I noticed he was low health, so I thought, well, I'll just ram him. So I did. Took him out. That was great fun. I loved it. I bet he was probably raging about it, but, you know, I don't know. We don't have cross-chat anymore, so no way to know anymore. Um, well, I guess I could have texted him after the battle. Hey, were you raging? <laughs> but I don't think that's... Uh, good thing to do. Now, I started to nose out there, but I noticed those uh, enemy tank destroyers, or at least one of them, the tortoise, was pointed down this way. And as you can see on the little mini-map, he's still moving this way, which means he's still pointed this way, and I don't want to drive out in front of a tortoise. <clears throat> it's a real short lifespan when you do that. But once I noticed he went around the corner, I pulled out, I shot the uh, Waffentrager out uh, Panzer IV. And then somebody else finished him off. Now here I'd see the tortoise is still turned away from me. And I try to dash out and get behind him. But unfortunately he had other plans and had already turned to, to shoot at me. And I end up taking a hit anyway. But I get away from him before he can reload again. So I come over to help this bat chat take out the mouse. And uh, I get a shot into his lower front plate. And he fires. And I don't know if he missed me or if he was aimed at the bat chat. But either way I didn't take that shot. Which is good because... I, I don't know if it would have finished me, uh, probably not, but it would have taken most of my health anyway. So here I get behind the mouse, and you can see I put a shot into the back of his turret. I shoot again, but I think that one went a little too high, I had the gun aim too high. So here we go, I shoot again, and I don't remember if that one pinned or not. Um, and unfortunately, while I'm recording this, the game volume is real low, so... And in any event, uh, the bat chat, or the bulldog gets next to him. I should put another shot into the back of the mouse's turret, and the uh, bat chat finishes him off. So that was a pretty good little takedown. The three of us combined together to uh, take down that mouse, and I think somebody else uh, might have been firing at the other side of him. That T-34 might have been. I'd have to go back and watch the replay again. But uh, I just thought that was really good work. Uh, the three of us 
you know, possibly four of us just worked together to uh, whittle away at that mouse and, and take him down. Unfortunately, a lot of times, um, I'm sure you all know, uh, you can find yourself fighting a tank all by yourself with little no support. And I don't know if you noticed, but nobody typed in there, you know, help or, you know, click the map and we just, we just all did it. We just converged. It was really good. Now, this is the last guy left alive, and I'm trying to get a shot on him, but he's behind the corner of the building, and there's a little snow mound right there, and, well, that hit the ground. So I'm going to try and scoot over a little bit here and get another shot, but other tanks are moving in as well. Now you can see, I can just barely see him, but before I could get aimed in, somebody else finished him off. And as you can see here, I got uh, second class. I did uh, 3,000 damage. I believe I was uh, second, yeah, second on XP. So it was a pretty good game, and on the uh, end screen here you can see I actually uh, netted 69,000 credits on that. Now the uh, the team worked pretty good here, and you know, I thought it was really good for a random pub game. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for joining me. Bye.